George Pito was a sergeant with K Company, 1st Marine Regiment, 1st Marine Division. During the invasion of Okinawa, L Company lost half their men when they attempted to take Hill 55. The company commander refused to make a second attempt. The colonel just relieved him right there and, and said to my lieutenant, Agerty, he said, you're company commander of L Company. So he said, well, if I gotta do that, he said, I want my sergeant to go with me. So we went over and we counted heads. There was 37 guys left. I didn't know any of them, never saw them before. And they didn't know him, but here we are all together doing this operation when the company commander refused to take them up. So old Haggerty, he said, well, men, he said, here's the plan. We're gonna charge up that dry wash like the hammers of hell. And he said, we're gonna be on them before they know what hit them. He looks at me and he says, and you bring up the rear, he said, and make sure every man follows. Every man took off, followed him. Not a one looked around. They all took off and followed him. I never was, I was, uh, that's the proudest. Was my proudest day in the Corps. <laughs> L Company raced up the hill and were met with heavy resistance from the Japanese. Only 11 company members survived the attack. George Pito served a total of 32 months overseas and took part in four campaigns, New Guinea, Cape Gloucester, Peleliu, and Okinawa. <laughs>